Hey, what's up guys? We're the Caper Couple. We're back once again today. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to subscribe and leave us a like. And today, guys, we're on our way out Lewisburg Highway. We may stop at a hiking trail, do a little hike. Not sure yet because the weather's not very great. It looks like it's going to piss poor rain. And it's cold out. It's not that bad out. It's, it's, it's cold, but it's, it's cold not. actually. Because last week was so nice, it was warm out. Oh, last week was great, guys. It For was November, like it was like 20 degrees almost. Yeah, it was actually. So you could actually wear shorts last week. People were. <laughs> yeah, what's up with that? Like it's, it's usually crazy. It's usually that cold this time of year. That snow is about to fall. Yeah, that was nuts weather, and it was like that for two days. So, we'll make our way, try and find this trail, guys, and if we don't, uh, not sure what we'll do over here, but... It's a Sunday day to get out for a drive, guys, that's all I could say. <laughs> if anything, guys, we'll have a little ride, so catch you back in a bit. Peace. So, guys, we're out in little rain right now. We're heading towards this hiking trail bus. There's what we're in for right now. It was hailing about two, three minutes ago. It actually still is a little bit. It's mixed with rain, though. So we may not be able to get any aerial footage, but if it stops, I certainly will. Look, guys. It's really coming down now. Check it out. It's rain mixed with hail. Like, wow. This is the type of crappy, cruddy weather we get this time of year. Mm -hmm. And last week it was uh, nice though. And last week it <laughs> was like, actually just a couple of days ago, maybe two, two or three days ago, it was 20 degrees, bubbling, boiling hot. Mm -hmm. And a week before that, we had a little snow on the ground, not uh, much. Yeah, a week before that, guys, we had like just enough to cover the ground. So we'll continue on here hopefully get to this trail and hopefully this crud stops so we'll catch you back then guys peace bye missy bye missy okay guys so we're here we're at the end of little rain um the hiking trail starts over on the beach over there guys see this blue place um, this this man we were just talking to there he used to live right on this very property all of his relatives are past and gone he lives in Ontario right now but he's down here for a visit no, he and said, he no, said no. he told me he lives in Sydney now he moved down oh here. yeah 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 he lives in Sydney now sorry guys sorry but he did live in Ontario yeah. but he's down here. and uh, he's looking to build back here again and so move here but he was just telling us this area here, all back on that back hill, used to be full of homes back in like the 60s. Watch where you're going. He said some spots here are really sinky. You'll okay. sink like two feet. Oh so you gotta be careful walking up the beach on here, guys. Like there are some soggy areas where, like I just said that he told us, you will probably sink up to two feet down. So, as you can see, it's an absolute beautiful spot. Lewisburg is just around the corner there. He told me the hiking trail, if you follow it, it'll take you about five hours, and it'll take you right to Manadu. Now, like I say, if you keep going and follow it, it'll take you down to Gooseberry Cove and Wild Cove. It's just in this outstanding area here, guys. Absolutely beautiful. It's always cold here. Like you're, you're over near Lewisburg. You're right on the water, right on the coast. You're, you're going to get that cold air. But we're going to walk over this way. Get over on the beach here and set up the Mavic Air 2 and get you guys some aerial footage of what it looks like here guys so you'll get a better understanding of the area I'm starting to get a runny nose because of this weather 
I actually don't like this time of year. Come on, Missy. Her hood is unstrapping. The, the fur on her hood's letting go. getting out today guys I slept in and I didn't feel the greatest when I got up because it was too late getting my medication into me and that's one thing about taking the Suboxone if you it, it's supposed to have a long half-life and you can even miss a day of it and my body was that used to it that you know I could miss a day but now the now that I'm taking it you know a certain time every day it seems that I uh, I tend to get a little sickly feeling if I don't get it into me in time I don't know if I'm gonna get messy across this so maybe we'll just put the drone up over here I think I'm gonna put the drone up around here babe because you won't cross that water <coughs> Unless you cross down here at the uh, right along the beach here. Chance, he it's, it's yeah. Okay, guys. So I'm guessing I'll set up here, maybe off of this flat rock, and we'll get you some aerial footage here. So I guess I'll catch you back once I'm done the flying. Okay guys, we're back. I got you the best I could. It actually started raining and hailing while I had that drone up in the air, so I had to bring it back as quick as I could. So I hope you enjoyed the view we did get you. And with that being said, guys, don't forget to subscribe, leave us a like. Make sure your post notifications are on so you don't miss any of our videos. Leave us a comment, guys, and until the next one. Smash that button, guys. Catch you later, guys. Peace.